So uh, there's a vote going on as we speak. Don't really know what's what's happening, but as I say, I care so very, very much. But uh, it's clear that the negotiations have moved in a, in a particular direction um, and that both sides are angling to uh, either claim credit or avoid blame. But uh, most of the... Uh, the, the the most sinuous, shall I say, the most sinuous dance in all this, I I, I would nominate the uh, occupant of the White House. And for further enlightenment into that, let's uh, let's turn on the TV. Father knows best. Hi, honey. I'm upstairs. <laughs> How was your day? Oh, pretty rough. No, oh, what's the matter, sugar? Are they still criticizing you for buying clothes at Target? No. Quite the opposite. Matter of fact, I think right now I'm more of a man of the people than someone else in this house I could name. No. But I have been having a devil of a time here. Oh, really? Yeah. Just no luck with this recipe. No. Well, can't the White House chef help you? No. It's for my own project. Oh. Well, what are you trying to do? Make an organic Twinkie. <laughs> oh, I have to admit, that does sound good. Mm -hmm. How was your day, sweetie? Oh, the usual. Speech about being the adult in the room. Press conference about being the adult in the room. And then, worst of all, trying, trying to, be to be the, the adult, adult in the room. room. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I, I guess we've sort of been doing the same thing, Sugar. Really? What's that? Well, taking out everything good and trying to make it go down without people ganging. Well, I suppose, but... Hey, kitten, why the long face? You're not a horse. <laughs> no, I'm not a horse. No. Then what's wrong? <sighs> Nothing. Hmm. Maybe I better let you two have some... Mom's not going to overhear this time. <laughs> okay, Pumpkin. What's up? The boys won't let us use the gym. Really? Mm -hmm. How come? Oh, it's stupid. Hey, honey, everything's stupid. <laughs> but uh, what did they say? Oh, they say we're not serious basketball players, mm -hmm. and it's a waste of gym time to let us have the court. Wow, that is stupid. I mean, haven't they ever seen Lisa Leslie or Tamika Catchings? Uh, well, I know there's more. But, Daddy, I'm four foot eight. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to play for the Fever or the Mercury or even the Mystics. Mm -hmm. But it's just so unfair. Well, honey, I'm sure there's some way to work it out. Uh, let's see. Um, would some chocolate ice cream help? <laughs> no. Oh, some, uh, what are these? Pickled watermelon balls? Uh-huh. Well, I'd offer you some organic Twinkies, but I know better. <laughs> well, look, Kitten, mm -hmm. how can they keep you from using the gym? Well, they and a bunch of their friends have reserved the gym all day long, all through the summer, 6 a.m. to midnight, seven days a week. Well, the good news is they've got to get tuckered out by August, don't you think? They don't even come and play. They just plunk down a deposit and go home and play video basketball. Oh, well, have you offered to split the time half and half with them? Uh-huh. Dominic McCoy, he's kind of their leader. Mm -hmm. He says he's not interested in half of anything. He says he won't even watch halftime shows on TV. Wow. Kind of hard line. Yeah. Well, how about if you knew someone who knew someone in the video game industry who could offer them the MVP version of the NBA video game with all the secret extras. I offered them that. And? They signed up, used the password your lobbyist friend gave us, and they still won't let us use the gym. <laughs> oh, well, he's not really a lobbyist, honey. Daddy. And he's not really a friend. <laughs> but... Any other bright ideas, Dad? Hey there, let's keep a tone of respect in your voice when you're being condescending to your father. 
But now look, honey, I, I know it's not what you and your friends would really want, but in situations like this, you just might have to settle for something less than the ideal. <laughs> like what, Dad? Well, how about if you and your friends offer to pay the boys back for their deposits, and then you get to use the gym when, well, maybe when it's closed? <laughs> To put it mildly, that sounds counterintuitive. No, you're right, kitten. It sure does. Maybe you should pay for their deposits and then dare them to keep control of the gym until school starts up again. Uh-huh. And, and, and what do we do in the meantime? Oh, I don't know. Well, you could help your mother try to make organic Twinkies. Mom! <laughs> Well, I am your mother. And we do have the technology. But you see, kitten, you don't have to win to show people you're strong. Sometimes the only way to teach a lesson to folks who don't want to compromise is to show them the price of getting their own way. Which is? Not getting dates for the Christmas dance. Oh, these boys don't go to the dance. Well, then they're just going to miss out on meeting nice girls like my kitten. Or daddy. And you get to be... The grown-up at the dance. Now come on everybody, let's go watch Jeopardy.